All right, peace. This is Demond Stiff with Austin Warrior Arts and Steph the Culture. And I have um, there we are. Okay, we're gonna demonstrate a little bit of um, ancient Egyptian long stick slash spear. Um, so we're gonna draw most of our information from the wall murals depicting this ancient Egyptian sport of water jousting. So uh, typically, uh, the guards you'll see is some will be facing up <coughs> towards the end, and it's kind of an awkward, awkward guard. So if you imagine, let me switch places with you. So you'll notice that these are some of the positions you'll find the fighters in. Now I believe that this position uh, was assumed by the, the fighters is because it allows them to use these harpooning style um, thrusting movements with the uh, spear or the pole. Um, anyway, so we're going to do a little bit of free play with this and then we're going to add in some different concepts into it. Okay, so starting off here, um, and of course I'll, you'll notice I'll be adjusting my hand to a more conventional uh, grip at some point. We'll start off with just the thrusting, so we're doing just a little bit of flow play with the thrust. Some of the targets you'll notice will be, at least like during, in the wall descriptions, will be um, the shoulder, the face, the body, and the leg. So now, what we're going to add is, I'm going to throw in these overhead strikes, okay? Ready? And go. So here, we're moving, and at any point when I can, when I can work it in, I'll throw in a, an overhead. Gotta excuse us, we're using PVC pipes to kind of demonstrate, uh, and they kind of wobble a little bit. So now next, um, we're gonna add in, not just these overhead strikes, but some of um, these lateral strikes as well. <clears throat> and you'll see this movement is kind of common in Tahib and common in Donga stick fighting. Um, so here we are. And ready, we work. So when I ever get a chance, there's my overhead. Here we go, I'll go to the side, boom, there we go. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, good. Now, another concept that we're going to add into this is going to be grappling. Now, there are some images of um, the guys when the boats have clashed, that two guys are kind of engaged in a, in a grappling match with the, with the sticks. Um, so, I'll just kind of work in from the flow into how we can get into a grappling situation. We'll go real slow. So here we are, and ready? So we're going, we're going. So I may move in here. A lot of times you'll notice in the images they have the stick kind of trapped here between the arms. I'm not gonna worry about that too much, but there we go. I went in here, I close in, I lift, and that could be my first throw. Once again, we're moving. Getting that flow going good here. And again, I may come in, what I'm gonna do now I'll come in and I'll do a throw like this. We'll turn it around so you can see what I'm doing here. So, we knocked it to the side. I came in underneath here and we'll pick them up. Okay, so that is um, Egyptian water jousting and we're using that to kind of build as a basis for developing uh, long spear play um, in ancient Egypt. All right, thank you guys for tuning in. And uh, train hard, train safe.